Huh? I've got a couple of ideas to tell you as well to, in terms of uh, the record table. So I want to do a talent show. Um, big thing, big ta talent show, scheduled one, you know what I'm the saying? Fine, the event. Uh, yeah, not only that, but to like, you know, make like an introduction to the city that we're a record label. A uh, big one, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm, trying, I'm talking like I want to see if I can get at least like 20 contestants in or like 15 contestants in. They don't have to be rappers. They can just be like any talent whatsoever, you know what I'm saying? But uh, each contestant is going to pay an entry fee. Uh, and and on, like in in return, they, they can win a cash prize. Or if they are an artist, then they get signed to the label and they get a signing fee, a signing bonus, which is like the same thing. It's like a cash prize as well as getting signed. You know what I'm saying? God love you. <clears throat> uh, second thing, I want to see if I can uh, start working with Pata. I want I want I want else to have a. Uh, uh, I want else to have his uh, studio sessions. So basically, we, we pull up. We have a producer, uh, producer who I basically I I offered Mark Yo, Vegas. Sexy face. Listen, how much is it to cost me? Uh, right. Mark Vegas a position in in Mandem Records yeah, as an executive producer because this guy is a fucking dirty producer. Uh, right. And I want to see if I can right, get him involved sure. in that. Right, and I want Els and him to be like uh, running uh, the the studio sessions, and it's basically going to be like uh, Patar and Jiggity Studios record record the whole thing, and we and we like get an artist, uh, a, a, like a relatively new artist in the city, and we uh, <laughs> like slap him, put him in the booth, put it like put a beat uh, for him, give him a beat. Give him some time to write, and um, then when he's ready, he comes over, he records an episode. So, like, a buy in the booth type thing, you know, mm -hmm. I hear you. type thing. They're both sick ideas. I rate that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so next thing uh, I'm promoting, uh, Molly's CEO, so she's going to be running uh, pop up events. She's going to be uh, running a lot of things uh, behind the scenes as well. Uh, she's got my full support, and like, I appreciate it if you man started, like, made her feel welcome in it because she, cause she, like, she doesn't feel like she really has a place in mdm records because we're all like you know uk and that but at the end of the day like she she's got mad fucking talent and she she <coughs> she can like really make shit happen and her pop-up <coughs> events are like banging uh whenever like in the in the like the tsunami after this one she usually does like pop-up events like a lot and like she has a set group of people that that she sells to and she cakes bro she brings in peas uh, she she's got bear match that she sells, uh, bear mix tapes that she sells. She brings in peas, isn't it? Uh, I already got her placement, so she's gonna be making a song for this business called Sakura Sushi. Uh, it's like a farmers market place right now, uh, but uh, she's gonna be running an advert. And in in as a proposal, I told her that like she can she can counter propose that instead she makes a song so that she can get a like a nice little paycheck from it. So I'm saying that, like, she, you know, it's going to be at least 60K because she needs to pay for rights for music, uh, beats, licensing, uh, and she needs to, like, write herself and use her creativity. So, like, I'm, I'm going to really start pushing for businesses to get custom songs made for them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I hear Because you. we have Jiggity, we can, like, literally do, a, like, a whole package where they literally pay us, like, a shit ton of money and we make a song that, like, a jingle. And then Patar works with the works with the other side of things, and he gets like commercials made uh, with the song that we have made with MDM Records. So it's like a full package thing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I hear you. What about like yeah. how are you gonna try and differentiate from Wu Chang in terms of like making money, right? Because fucking hard hit money is music artists. That's that's l like what I just said about the placements. So you wanna do it on that's, on that front, yeah? I'm I'm hoping I'm hoping that that's the like the because like I can't I can't lie <laughs> if it's not that then I like I'll be very honest we we will fail because the and only is, reason Wu Chang so successful projects. exactly because uh, the reason why Wu Chang so successful is because they got like fucking infinite backing from the government fucking my fucking fucking Chang gang you know what I'm saying they got deep ass pockets uh but. Yeah. There's also Pixify, but I don't want to put my 
my like my focus is on Pixel Five because they're their own business. But they work. They're gonna be clo working closely with us, and I fucking hope that these men get their shit together and actually like fully launch their shit so that they can try and get like an app on the on the phone and shit. So yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's uh, that's the last part of those. Yo, though. what up, my G's? Big things are going. Big things are going. What up? Uh, what up? Hey, y'all want some coke? Y'all want to buy some coke? What the fuck are going, fam? Yeah, what yeah. What's good? Me, man? What up? What up? Me, I, bro, I saw you get licked in the apartments. Uh, Let me see your chin. Yo, what up, Tommy? How you doing, brother? Are you Tommy, you're you're good? Yeah, Tommy. Yo, I'm re revamping the whole fucking sports like by man. the way. I don't know yeah, what bro, the fuck bro, happened with the payments and shit, but I'm gonna I'm gonna go through it probably tonight. And pay that everybody. The and then, uh, you good? I don't even know who's doing it anymore. Same. <laughs> bro, I have no idea who the fuck is doing them, bro. I mean, who's who are these people? So, is it this Nikolai guy? Yeah, I don't know, bro. I, I, I gotta talk to Dean uh, um, listen, tonight. My guy, I can't lie, I'm gonna let him know, and then um, I know Alan. Alan. Alan, uh, Alan be doing that shit, yeah. I'm pretty sure he does the know. basketball shit, right? Victor, Victor does that Formula One. Nikolai does, I think, uh, some other shit. And I don't know. I don't Delmar don't do anything. Rainy doesn't do shit. Vinny doesn't yeah, do anything. Yeah, do I'm about to remove all these motherfuckers. I mean, I don't do shit right now. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yo, I can, can do stuff. NBA yeah, but you are OG bitch. though. You are OG bookie. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, NBA the NBA OG. Come on. You want to? What's yeah, your number? Right. Yo, hey, who got 40k in their account See, my, right now? Mine should say Corona, oh, wait, how much does really. Cost, okay? 44k? What does it say? Yo, yo, Adam, give him, uh, yeah, yeah, give him your I'm ID. I'm saying my name should say Co-Owner. Co-Owner? Yeah, that's what I should say. Send it over, Adam. Okay. Right, my man, you co -owner. I'll give you one dollar. Oh, yo, Adam. come here. Hold on, hold on. Yo, yo, Tommy, 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 Tommy. What? Hang on. Steady, steady, steady. 10804. 10804. Are you sick, by the way? Yeah, really sick. Hey, man, I feel better, bro. Yo, Appreciate listen, that. uh, I'm a, I want my, I'm, I, how much is a single room at the hotel? Uh, well, there's small, medium, large, right? So there's, yeah. it's 20K, 24K, 28K. 18084? Okay. 10804. Is, is there like a, is there like a homie price you can give on the small one or no? A homie price? What, you can't afford 20K? Nah, but I mean, I can, but I'm saying like, I thought it was like 16 or some shit, no? Why am I getting charged 50 bags? Who the fuck's charging money for? Huh? So, sorry, hang on. Dean fam, what the fuck is this? Bro, I'm about to give it back to you, bro. Okay, let me yeah. fucking tell me next time. I I, you, I told you. All right, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah. So you want the homie price? Yeah, is it like a homie price you can hook me up with? What kind of price you want? You want 16? Yeah, can you use 16 or not? Nah? We do 18. All right, we'll do 18. Um, I'll get, um, I'm going to get, uh, my CEO to buy a room for, from you. Okay. And then I'm going to get keys to it. So then, so I can store all my shit there. Cause she's clean. Yep. I don't have nice. to worry about any other shit. You know what I'm saying? 600 storage on a small room, right? You know that. Yeah. Yeah. That's fine. That's <coughs> fine. I don't care about that. And, uh, yeah. Can they, what if I actually, can you do me? Well, you, if I you, know, you know what? You don't, ID. you don't even have to, unless like, do you have to want to wake up there? You don't have to wake up there. You could just have access to the storage. No, no, no. I want to wake up there as well. Can I not wake? If I have keys to it, can I wake up there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Can, do, I, do you need her state ID or no? Or like, do you need her? Or can I give you her state ID? You can give me all the intel from all the info from her. That's it. You can give me okay. all her info, and then I can do it from there. Okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. All right, but I'll no. give you her state ID, and then I'll uh, I'll, I'll I'm gonna go to the town hall right now and do it, and then um just give me tell me what room number it is, and then I'll give you my state ID as well, and then I'll pay for a month out right now. I'll give you straight up uh. What is it, 18? So I'll give you a, 72. Uh, yeah, 72K. All right. All right? Yeah, easy. All right, but appreciate it. Thank you, Tommy. No worries. Hey, it's a hell, bro. Oh, wait. Hold my advance. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. 